Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your mid-June 2018 reading. Um, thank you to all who have liked, shared, comment, subscribed to the channel. It's much appreciated. Uh, let's go ahead and get into this. Okay, so we'll start with love first. We'll save the announcements for the end. Let's see, close, close, and get some. I hope that everyone is having a really good summer. All right. Thank you for the messages for Leo. True, accurate messages for Leo. Messages of love and light. What are the love messages for Leo? The love messages for Leo. First card will be you. All right. Second card. Are you on your correct path in love? Third card. What's your main obstacle here? Okay. These two wanted to come out. So we'll take them. Fourth card. Who's, who or what is helping you? Fifth card. How can progress be made? All right. Bottom of the deck, the three of water. It talks about celebration, uh, being going to a wedding, just out celebrating, having fun. It, it can even talk about reconciliation. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio here. Of course, it can talk about third party situation, but we don't know that. Okay. All right, let's go. Leo, right where they are, the world. Okay, mm -hmm. so a cycle, a phase has ended. Something has phased out, cycled out. The world card is here. Uh -huh. You've gone as far as you can go in a situation, in a certain mindset, in a certain uh, predicament, relationship. I mean, let's see. Are you in your correct path? The emperor, nice. Uh, taking charge, large and in charge. Taking control of the situation. And the lion is here, and that's Leo. Um, and it's a four card, so it's definitely about stability. I think you are on your right path. You're taking control of things, because you know a cycle has ended. Something's phased out here. And you just need to get back in control of your life, of your being, so that you can uh, manifest whatever it is you want for yourself main obstacle the high priestess six of fire so it looks like once you start listening to your intuition once you gain higher knowledge of yourself and people involved in a certain situation you'll have victory here this is Leo Aries Sagittarius six of fire victory you might even have help in, in, in your business, in your relationship, just help in general. But you have to let yourself be led by spirit and your intuition. First you have to be aligned with spirit, then spirit speaks to you, and then you're led. Now, if you're so far away from you, whatever your spiritual belief is, whatever your hierophant is whatever your spiritual guidance uh, counseling um, mm -hmm. then of course you need to go backwards and, and, and get back aligned so that you can have victory diaparesis talks about secrets too uh, some secrets may take you okay what I'm hearing is some, some of you need to not let too many people in on what you're doing or how you're doing it uh, so that you can have success in this. Everyone doesn't need to know what's going on. That's your obstacle. What's helping you? The ace of air. So, yeah, truth and clarity comes in for you. By way of communication, the sword of truth. This sword cuts, it divides, it's decisive. When this type of energy communication comes in, you don't think the same. You don't do the same. It's a new start by way of knowing something new. Something that you can't really deny. You know? You can't really push this down unless you just really. You're so deep and boggled down in denial. You know? 
How can progress be made? Eight of air. How can progress be made? Eight of air. The eight of air it speaks of. Uh, hmm. How can progress be made? The eight of air. Wow. That's a challenge. You need to you need to think about you need to go over your thoughts in a certain situation. Some of you may feel tied to an air sign. How progress can be made is to free yourself mentally. Some of you don't see a way out of a certain situation. So this is about getting to a place of of freedom. Whether it's um, you know, actual freedom. Some of you could be jailed, uh, or it's getting to a place of um. You might need to go backwards with the Seven of Swords and devise a plan of action so you can move forward. Uh, you want to go through the stages of the the Air cards or the Swords cards. Go through the Nine of Air, the Ten of Air, and then Ten of Air is just where it completely ends. It's done. You can no longer can go over this situation mentally. You no longer can feel uh, backstabbed and, and betrayed in your mind, firstly. And, and it could be physically too, emotionally. The three of waters here. Let's get a few clarifying cards. What is the world for Leo? What is the world for Leo? What's the world? Okay. Eight of Earth. So something surrounding maybe work or putting work into something is ending. You go into the next phase. Some of you could be in school, could be under some kind of uh, schooling or learning something new, putting work in on yourself because something has ended. The emperor definitely um, is you getting in control. What is the eight of air? I'm stuck here. What is the eight of air? How can progress be made with the eight of air? Okay, there's way too many. How can progress be made with the eight of air? How can progress be made? All right. Five of earth, nine of earth, messenger of earth. Yeah, it looks like it's about freeing yourself. Eight of air, five of earth. Five of earth. Um, you got to come out of that lack mentality or the, or the feeling like you're not good enough, feeling like you can't do it, feeling like uh, stuck, feeling less than. Know that you are the nine of earth. Uh, the man or the woman in waiting, abundant, creative, mature. You might have to give this message to either an air sign or an air sign is coming to you to give you a message of their truth. You may have to, like I said, free yourself from an air sign. You know, become single. Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What is the three of water? The ten of water. So it's like maybe with a water sign, there's happiness, there's reconciliation. Yeah, positive. Oh, okay, you got to make a decision about it. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. The final decision. You've been with this person before. You know this person. You've been through a lot with this person. Nine of fire. Okay. So that's the love messages. For some of you dealing with air, you might have to just go ahead and cut ties. And get back in control. Listen to your intuition with um, 
listen to your intuition uh, for if you're dealing with a water sign it can very well be that listen to your intuition you guys can have success here with them okay let's do some career and finance messages career and finance messages for Leo career and finance messages for Leo Okay, Queen of Sword, Four of Cup, Nine of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, the top. All right, bottom of the deck, the High Priestess. Okay. Um. Okay, bottom of the deck, the High Priestess again. Uh, some of you could really be holding on to plans, plans of action. You know something. Some of you know someone's pregnant. Somebody's gotten somebody pregnant. You know something. You're holding on to this. It's like this is the... Um, the ace in, in the hole, I guess, or whatever you call it. You know, it's like you're, you're keeping it because you need to use that information. Career and finance. You're the nine of pentacles. You look very good career wise. Um, you could very well be getting uh, a message of. Uh, of emotional fulfillment surrounding career but then we have the tower here there, there could be some abrupt changes in your career could be dealing with the air sign Gemini Libra Aquarius you could feel like you missed an opportunity here the Queen of Swords is strategic logical well put together she's been through a lot so she knows a lot and that may be your knowing that something is might come to an abrupt halt. What's the tower? What is the tower? Seven of Cups, King of Pentacles. Though this is supposed to be career and finance, it really looks like love. Like somebody finds out that someone has been unfaithful here. Could be a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Someone knows, though. You either know, Leo. You know about, yeah. You're being very defensive about messages of love, maybe from a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Some of you are... You're not taking to any advances. Yeah, you're not taking, and then you show up. The strength card, Leo. You're definitely being strong in, in regards to maybe a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You're not going to take to that advance. You know that they did something, or they are doing something. Who is the nine of pentacles? Who is the nine of pentacles? Two of Cups, the world, once again, it looks like an ending to a relationship. You're choosing to be single, Leo. You you don't want to go back. You don't want to take to that advance. You know, there's messages of love here from this person external to you, but you're completely defending your stance on this relationship. Could be with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You may find out that someone has been unfaithful or vice versa. They find out that you've been unfaithful, Leo. There might be children involved here. Yeah. The father of your child, Leo. There might even be another child here on the way. Yeah. Okay. 
let's get some messages of advice for Leo. Thank you for the additional messages of advice for Leo. True. Messages of advice for Leo. Messages of love, light, truth, and clarity. bottom of the deck new exercise program it's pretty self-explanatory all right forgiveness realizations and epiphanies yeah with that high priestess in both spreads like you guys are going to realize something you've had an epiphany you know what's going on now you're devising a plan of action to, to end of an era with the world twice and ending here ending because somebody decisions yeah you gotta make a, dis a decision about what you're gonna do. I think that eight of air was, that's how progress can be made. You just go over it, go over it mentally because what you're thinking is you're spot on because you've realized and you've had an epiphany. You may have to ask for forgiveness or grant someone forgiveness, release them, release the, the situation. Doesn't mean you forget about what they did or what they didn't do, but release them in love and light and then work on your own healing. I, I know it sounds so redundant and so all oh, sounds so easy just to release somebody, you know, after what they've done and what they put me through. Granted, um, I'm not speaking at you, I'm speaking with you. I've been there several times. And it wasn't until I just said, you know what, I'm just gonna forgive. Forgive them because, you know, like the good book says, they. They know not, you know, they know not what they do. Um, you'll find that the best revenge, of course, as you probably heard before, is living well. You don't live well if you're harboring unforgiveness and walking around with problems that you you can't really solve. Um, because it's a problem within someone else. So, anyway... Um, if this resonated with you, Leo, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, yeah, Leo. Forgiveness. You realize something is over. Now you need to make the decision to move away from or to heal or whatever. Uh, put some energy into yourself. Okay. Wow. And then needs to courage in moving. Some Yeah, some of you just decided maybe to move, having the courage to just walk away. Uh, put some energy into yourself. New exercise program. Right. Okay, Leo. Remember that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care and I will see you. I'm going to try to do some love readings. Some strictly love readings. You know, because that's what everybody wants to know. Oh, also, take advantage of the new special. So it's um, $10 for one question. All right. I'll pull up to five cards. Whatever the question is. Is he cheating? Is she cheating? Is he a liar? Does he like me? Does he have someone else, basically? I mean, those are the questions. And it's, and it's strictly for love. $10 love question. One question. Uh, we'll see what the cards have to say in regards to that, okay? All right, so take advantage of that. Um, email me if you want to take advantage of that. Email address is below. All right, take care.